they call me I promise that you'll never be lonely Be the fan that's I didn't get any. No? No. Danger Squad, what is up guys? It's me, Moto Jr. here, and we're here with his most fa favorite snake. And I beat him. Maybe. So, Ryder, what's your most favorite snake's name? What's his name? No, not how old. What's his name? Night. Sniper, that's right. So, he really likes Sniper, guys. You guys hear him randomly talk about that all the time. We're going to let him throw in, be fast, just throw it. Oh, come on, buddy. All right, that's good. Because Sniper might be hungry and we don't want him to get you. Yes, Because Sniper might be hungry and we don't want him to get you. Yes, this is him, him hungry. He is hungry, guys. Oh my goodness. That's a spicy little sandwich that he's yeah, eating there. I'm not that hungry. But in Brooklyn, That's right. He's talking about the frogs now, guys. But we're, we are working on Sniper, Ryder. What are you talking about? <laughs> this is your boy here. You almost knocked the camera over and everything trying to feed him. Yes, me, I don't know. Yeah? Alright. We might make this a three-part series on this video, guys. We'll wait until Sniper finishes his rat, and then we'll hit it on time-lapse, so, so you guys can see the swallowing. Then we'll jump up to the champagne and finish it off with the Ghost Lesser Spider. So make sure you stay tuned, guys. We're going to hopefully, yeah. we'll have this be a yeah. three-part yeah. video. Deacon Spider just died. Deacon Spider died a long time ago, buddy. Mm -hmm. Sorry, guys. He's all over the place. All right. So what's, what's Sniper going to do after he uh, gets the mousey to go to sleep? After him... This is how the baby and and him and him did the old rat. I have no idea what you just said, buddy. But Sniper is going to dehinge his jaws. He is going to open his mouth really wide to be able to swallow that little feller down. Guys, the way snakes do things is incredible, guys. I'm just here trying to bring it to you so you guys can see it firsthand exactly how they would do it in the wild. Besides being in a controlled environment, obviously. and But these guys, they would smell out their prey. They would take, go down their little barrows. They would get them in there, you know, and, and bush them. Basically what you would see here, like, except for me putting it in there, the mouse would just kind of creep up past them, not knowing that the snake is there because they are masters of camouflage. And boom, spicy sandwiches all day. All right, guys, me and Moto Jr. will return in a second. We're going to hit this on time lapse, guys. Thanks so much. We'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. We're here with the champagne ball python, and she snapped at the glass when I took it down, so I'm pretty sure she's going to eat. We'll put her there, see if we can get her to chase it down. Oh, she is messed up, guys. She's waiting. She said, my food comes to me, because I'm a diva. I'm a bad girl. Boom! Shock. Girl. Boom! 
shakalaka guys. That's a documentary video right there if I'd ever seen one. Spicy nuggets all day, guys. And we'll finish up this video with uh, the Ghost Lesser Spider, like I said. We're getting some bicycle action, guys. Might even get some helicopter action. I don't know. Guys, this is pretty good enrichment for these guys, so I recommend it, but it's not for everybody, and you know, it's not a necessity, but it's good for their mental well-being. Guys, I'm pretty sure this mouse is done. I'll help her out, get her back in there. Oh no, it's not done. I thought it was. Even I'm wrong sometimes, guys, believe it or not. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, we're going to let it off at this. We're going to go up to the Ghost Lesser Spider. Make sure you stay tuned. We got one more coming, guys. Be right back. All right, Danger Squad, we are here with the Ghost Lesser Spider, and she looks super hungry, guys. I don't know, guys. She is probably going to tear this thing up. Oh, my gosh. She's trying to come after me while I have it up here. Hey, look. Hey, hey, hey look. It's over here, girl. Go get it. Go get it. Go fetch, Sneaky. Go fetch. Go get yourself some marshmallow fluff. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Go get it. Scroll this down here a little bit because it's going to be like, bam, spicy sandwich time or spicy marshmallow fluff, huh? I seen they got those hot peeps. Oh, oh, she is striking on everything, guys. She is tripping. These guys do have neurological problems, the ghost lesser spiders, just part of their uh, genes, like head shakes and head wobbles. Sometimes they do some crazy stuff, but they're, they're good to go. I don't see no suffering in her, so she's doing good. She's going to eat that super spicy sandwich there, guys. Bump, bump. These are the three ball pythons I have, guys. I will not get any more ball pythons. I might maybe down the road try breeding these guys, but other than that, I, I don't really have too much of a desire for ball pythons. They're beautiful snakes. They're a very manageable size for, you know, holding and teaching your kids how to properly hold them and all that, but they're just not for me. I mean, I love them and all the ones I got, but that's that's it. I'm not going to go out there and buy a giant collection of ball pythons. All 
All right, guys, it looks like that mousey is done. I don't see no movement. That was a very, very quick, efficient kill. Perfect example of predator and prey, guys. They try to do it super fast for a few reasons. One, and the biggest one is they don't want to get hurt in the process of hunting their food. And two, they don't want it to suffer. Unlike lions and some of those other big cats and other mammal predators man they those guys are vicious all right guys we're gonna hit this on time lapse thank you so much for hanging out and watching all three of the ball python z guys i will catch you guys on the next one yeah